the Houston area and really all across Texas' best barbecue joints are going to be in one place, one time, one price. It's the 7th Annual Houston Barbecue Festival happening up in Humble. Please welcome. We are joined this morning by Lance and Boo Acre of Acre Barbecue, one of the featured food trucks. Good morning. Hey, good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Thank you. Well, y'all, this is one of the bucket list items for a lot of people, right? Okay. Going to this festival. Well, it is for us, too. This is our first time uh, first time appearing, but uh, we've gone multiple times in the past to visit, and now we actually get to show up and uh, you know, serve some of our food. Yeah. So I want to show folks how popular your barbecue is. We have none of it left. <laughs> what happened here? Well, I, I, the, the carnivores uh, ascended on us and uh, ripped up our uh, our bones. <laughs> our, everybody inside Fox 26 came and wiped you clean there. There is nothing left there. How would you describe your barbecue style? I, I would go uh, Central Texas with a South Texas flair. Mm -hmm. So we do uh, mesquite with a little bit of post oak, but other than that, it's very Central Texas style. All smoked on, on, on wood then the whole yes, time? All, all wood. All wood. Okay, so you have moved on to the desserts. Is this something people are going to be able to, to try? Yes, gonna, we're going to kind of do an appetizer uh, first hour um, and then do a uh, main course second hour and then dessert third hour. So we're going to be doing these in uh, the last hour, the kind of pie, uh, pie bars, uh, bites and lemon cookies. Oh, those look so delicious. I can't wait to try one. So the idea here is uh, all these different vendors, people can go around and eat as much as they can. Yes, ma'am. 28 of the best restaurants and uh, pop-up vendors in, in Houston and surrounding area. Uh, they'll be featuring all kinds kinds of crazy stuff so you'll you may even see some whole hog smoking out going on out there it would take a long time to go around all these different places around the city so to be able to do it in one place at one time is pretty cool absolutely so you guys had very different careers before getting into the barbecue industry right i'm a 20-year it uh professional and then uh, my wife was uh what did you do I was a fashion designer for about 15 years. You made yuppie baby clothes. <laughs> so now, how did you get inspired to go into barbecue? Uh, apparently, we're crazy people. Uh, we don't care for our time, and we, we, we prefer to just to work. <laughs> no, we, we just uh, we started playing with it a while back and uh, decided that was going to be our second uh, second hit on life. And you're alongside some of the most incredible pit masters. You're still learning every day. What, what do you learn from, from these guys who have been doing this for years uh, and years? Little tricks. I was talking to Wayne Miller uh, a while back, and he, he taught us a little trick on uh, where you have little hot spots on your pit and how you can uh, how you can alleviate that and still use that that area. There's always something to learn. Always something to learn. That's pretty cool. So for an event of this size, uh, what? How long do you start preparing for this? You'll get out there. Today, tomorrow? We, we've been prepping all week, but uh, we'll be out there tomorrow starting to do the cook with the, the beef ribs and some pulled pork for our loaded fries that we will do in the first hour, and then hang out with the guys and get to know everybody. So there's still tickets available for tomorrow. It's the Houston Barbecue Festival. For Sunday, yes, oh, for Sunday I'm sorry. Thank you. Uh, happening again at the Humble Civic Center, and where do people go for tickets? HOUBBQ.com. You can get your tickets there. Uh, the uh, general admission is 60 from uh, 1 to 4, and then if you want to get in early and make sure to kind of beat the lines, the VIP is 120 and it gets you in at noon. Very good. All right, I'm going to end with my pecan bar bite, right? Yes, this looks delicious. Mmm. I'm having it in my mouth. Hey, thank you guys so thank much for coming. Thanks for having us. Have a great time on Sunday. Oh, we will. We'll send it back inside. Cheryl.